This video, I actually want to do a little different than some other videos. I'm going to do an unboxing of something that I love, uh, not just the character with Gojo, um, but also uh, just Nendoroids in general and how cool they are, these cool little figures that come with all these different features. And they can be a little bit expensive, but you can see the quality. So, and after we finish with all the unboxing, we're going to get into a sketch with one of the poses that we finish with. So let's get straight into this Nendoroid, what's in the box. You can see the box is a little faded from being in the sun, which I probably shouldn't have done. But yeah, there's a lot of stuff to unpack here. Um, first we have this stand and they, uh, they actually made them a lot smaller than they used to be, which I like. Um, and then we have the main figure, but also it comes with a few extra hands and a leg. And uh, yeah, here you can see all the features of this. Pieces can come off real easy, but they're also, they also stay secure most of the time. Um, and the head swivels, the legs move. Uh, you can see on the back, there's a place to connect it to the stand. And a lot of these pieces pop off from the head to the hands to the legs. And uh, here we have a couple extra faces. You can see we got to get the crazy eyes, but also the, the serious eyes. And actually they, they use a lot of plastic to cover parts that they don't want scratched, which is really nice because you know you're going to get it in good condition when you first open it um, without something getting scratched in the box. So here's all the other extra pieces. Got to have the little mochi hand, of course, um, and then the hand in the pocket for, you know, relaxed, chill look, the praying hands when you're getting spiritual, and of course the uh, infinity domain fingers. So yeah, let's go ahead and pop some stuff off so you can see what this actually looks like. Sometimes the pieces are a little harder to get off, uh, but I wanna see if this hair fits and actually no, it doesn't It doesn't really fit here. So that means you can only use uh, the mask with the crazy hair, uh, but you can use the faces, all the different faces on this, which is great. Yeah, I want to just mess around, see a few different options that we can do, make something cool from it, and then uh, pick one and do a sketch of it. So here's the hand in the pocket option, holding the mochi, chilling, eating. Uh, it also came with these really cool glasses. They have some plastic things that you slide in on the sides. And yeah, here's what it looks like when it's on the stand. So we're gonna go with this last pose where he's uh, eating his mochi and chilling. But I didn't want to do the chibi figure. I just wanted to use it as a reference. So uh, I already did the rough sketch, and now we're getting into the lining. Uh, I really like to use a brush pen um, on this kind of lining, especially for most of the main pieces, because it allows for great control over the variation in your line thickness. Um, which really adds character, I think, and also it's the style that I'm going for. And then I usually switch to a smaller, like, Copic pen and use that for details that I'm a little more worried about to use the brush on or if I don't trust my control while using the brush. Things like eyes, eyelashes, and then adding all the other little details. One of the other things um, that I'm trying to do is also push my black inks more because uh, it's scary when you're filling stuff in with black, but it really makes things pop. And then because I'm doing it mostly black and white, I wanted to add just a little bit of color. And since we don't have his eyes to work with, uh, we're just gonna use a really light blue and kind of add some color to his hair and his eyes. And there it is, all done. I hope you enjoyed watching the sketch, hearing a little bit about the figures that I enjoy. And if you like this kind of stuff, leave a comment down below for me. And as always, keep creating and be inspired. Thank you.